pipe routing. Solo Plan 3D offers no less than four ways to do the pipe routing. This video will show three of them, starting with manual route. This way of routing is the most straightforward one. I just start from a nozzle on this pump and draw the line to find my way to the tank. This way of routing might not be the fastest way, but it is the most intuitive one. You don't have to worry about the exact position of the line, because Solid Plan makes it very easy to route freely at first and then later adjust the line to make it match any structures or equipment. I can even break the line and reattach it after I move the other segment of the line. This way of routing gives you the flexibility when working on a small project. After the routing is done, I can select pipes, flanges, gaskets and elbows based on the piping specification that I built earlier. The program will generate a 3D pipe with realistic looking components. The manual route allows me to easily create a branch line and attach it to the main one. A T is automatically placed and the two merged lines are instantly adjustable as one. Next up is Auto Route, a time-saving way of routing that only requires a start and end nozzle. After both nozzles have been selected, a preview line will appear. The preview line can be adjusted and turns into a 3D model after the components have been selected. Even after the 3D model has been generated, the line can be modified. One of the most extraordinary routing features not only in SolidPlan but in the entire industry is Multiroute Navigator. This feature allows you to generate preview lines of as many route lines as you want. From the line list, I can select for which route lines I want to generate the previews. For this video, I'll check four of them. When I click Route, the preview between the nozzles will be generated. By selecting a single line, which will then be indicated by red arrow marks, I can choose from 8 different alternative route lines. Of course, I can also modify the preview line manually. When I'm ready to convert the preview line into a 3D model, I just select the line, select the chain, and convert the entities. After which, the program will ask me to select the components from the specification. The end result of this feature will be a 3D pipe with realistic looking components. You can imagine the time savings when using Multiroute Navigator. I can apply the same process to all preview lines and end up with a set of great looking pipes. Placing pipe supports in Solo Plant is a piece of cake. I can select one of the many available templates and drag it into the drawing. Everything about this pipe support can be modified, from the length of the legs to the size of the U-bolts and screws. The last part of this video shows how easy it is to place a smart valve into a line. Either at the selection point or at the start point of a line, the valve can be placed before giving it a tag and selecting the valve from the specification. The 3D model will include flanges, gasket and bolts, and a hand wheel that can be rotated in any angle.